Michelle, I'm in Sicily, I'm with uh, Everything is Possible on the Erasmus and I'm here with Aston Bryan. Hi, I'm CB and I'm 17 years old and I am studying at Aston Bryan College in York and we're in Catania at the moment in Sicily with Everything is Possible doing a hiking trekking project. I'm Tajund, I'm from Harrogate and I'm 18 years old and I go to Ask and Brian College and do outdoor adventure sport level 3. Hi, my name's Molly and I'm a 17 year old student at Ask and Brian College. Hi, I'm Sophie and I'm from Ask and Brian College on a two week project in Sicily with everything is possible. Hi, I'm Maddie from Ask and Brian College and I am here with everything is possible on a two week project in Sicily. Hi, my name's Hannah and I am 20 years old. I come from Wakefield in West Yorkshire and I am here with my college Ask and Brian in York. Um, I've come with Everything is Possible to do a project in Catania um, in Sicily for two weeks. Our guide Lorenzo took us to various different activities such as trekking, kayaking and to high ropes courses which will be the sort of activities we will be going into in the future after this course. Hi, my name is Ted Pugh from Oscar Bryan College uh, and I'm going to be talking about the two-week Sicily trip and the accommodations we stayed in while there, such as Hostel del G Elefanti and the refuges we used while camping on Mount Etna. And on the Sicily trip we did about five days of hiking. For three of those days we just single day hikes and we, we went back to the hostel after those hikes. For um, two of those days, we we camped on the side of Etna, and then we walked back down the second day. We learned a lot whilst we were on the on the um, educational visit from Lorenzo, our tour guide. We learned about how it was formed, the different rocks, when the last eruption was that it covered a old ski resort. We also learned about how it erupts, where it erupts, where's it erupt, where it's erupted, um, that it's a gaseous volcano. Thank you for listening. While hiking, we came across many cabins along the path where campers could stay the night and relax. We stayed in one large enough to fit a few of us and it was very scenic looking over the valley while well, we had dinner that night and enjoyed the fire and had a good sleep until a good hike the next morning. Really done me some good is I've seen how different companies work with Lorenzo, he's been our tour guide. We've seen how he works, just how he takes us round what the deal is there and we went kayaking as well so i've seen how that worked that whole company worked this project has enabled me to become very independent uh, especially in a foreign country um, which has been quite an experience we've been able to you know explore the area ourselves in groups um, and being able to try loads of different foods um, i've been having to budget we had a couple of meals out which i pushed myself to try some new food and seeing as they were near the coast i thought it was the best time to try seafood which i tried an oyster which i didn't like and along with all other fish such as prawns, mussels, squid, octopus. Hi, I'm Sophie and when we were on our project in Sicily we were experimenting with the different foods we had out there like trying different foods, mostly seafood like 